By the end of the decade, the number of officials in the area had more than doubled, and they had printed numerous defamatory news articles targeting the newly appointed and West-friendly de facto president, Zia Rahman. The KGB were heavily involved in Afghanistan in the late 1970s. They had heavily influenced political leadership in the country and sought to control it by placing a puppet president in the leadership role. But they were thwarted when the second president, Hafizullah Amin, took control of the country. They found themselves less able to control and influence his leadership. He wrote memos in English and spoke regularly with the United States. Eventually, the KGB claimed he was an American spy and undertook the successful operation of Storm 333, where they assassinated Amin. Their actions marked the start of the Soviet-Afghan War, 